Well, on this Christmas Eve, a Kent County family is hoping for a miracle after they lost their home, their Christmas tree, and most of their gifts. And now with Christmas Day just hours away, the parents are wondering what they're going to do for their three young kids. 24 Hour News 8's Ken Colker is at the live desk with more on their story. Ken? Yeah, Brian, for three young boys who couldn't wait for Christmas, this couldn't have come at a worse time. The fire started about 10 this morning on Ramsdale Avenue north of M57 in Oakfield Township. Everything we had was in there. Robert Joldersmo was next door at his parents' home in the hot tub with his three sons. Noah, who was 10, and his six-year-old twin brothers James and John. Their mom was out shopping. Joldersmo rushed to his home after his brother spotted the flames. The family's German Shepherd Marley was trapped inside. I opened up the door, the door fell apart on me and it was done, you know. At that point, it's like my brother pulled me away, said there's nothing left. The fire, we're told, started in a back bedroom, nowhere near the Christmas tree, but spread quickly despite a quick response from firefighters. All of the stuff we bought for the boys is gone. They said it melted underneath the stump of a tree. Jolders must said they were renting the home, trying to save for a bigger house, but that they had recently canceled insurance to pay for his wife to finish school. Now we're back to square one. After the flames were gone, firefighters carried out gifts. Three of them, early deliveries from Santa, found tucked away in a closet, including a Hot Wheels racetrack and a small acoustic guitar. They were badly charred. If there was a bright spot, that was what it was. I'll have to look, see if they're any good. The American Red Cross showed up with some gifts and was trying to get clothes for the boys who ran around Grandma and Grandpa's house in big T-shirts. Tonight at 6, one of the boys had a question for Grandma after the fire. Is Santa can find us? Now the family's dog died in that fire, despite the efforts to try to save him. And the family is staying next door with the grandparents. If anyone wants to help, we have more information inside our story at woodtv.com. Back to you.